The second principle that animates the left is group justice rather than individual justice. There's another name for group justice, that's social justice. Social justice, you should understand, is actually evil. Social justice, when people say it, it's an actual evil. Because anytime you put a modifier in front of a, a term that is inherently good, you turn it into a perversion of itself. So correctness, right? If you are correct, there's truth and there's something false, you are correct. Once you add political in front of that, you're not talking about truth and falsity anymore. You're talking about if you say the wrong thing, you get shot. Which is why, by the way, political correctness was a term that was coined by Mao. It was. It's a, political correctness comes straight from the Maoist handbook. And, and the same thing is true of social justice. Justice is a good. You do something, it's either good or it's bad, and you get what you deserve. That's what justice is. Add social in front of that, and you're inherently saying injustice is better than justice. Because whether you are guilty or whether you are innocent is irrelevant. If you're a member of a group, then you must pay the price for something that you didn't do. Right? Social justice suggests that you know, I, as a, as a supposedly white man, you know, Jews became white people as soon as we became successful in America. Um, Jew, you know, I, as a, as, a, as a white man, I'm responsible for paying slavery reparations, for example, in the name of social justice, even though all of my ancestors were busy getting killed by Cossacks in Russia at the time that slavery was taking place. And less than 5%, 5% of white Americans alive today have ancestors who ever held slaves. The, the, every white person in America, though, has to pay because of group justice. How is that just? It's not, but it's group justice. It's social justice. And, and valuing the collective, valuing people in terms of groups rather than individuals, is how you get to the point where murder in the name of the collective is okay. All you have to do to, to see this is, is just compare the American Revolution, which was about individualism, with the French Revolution, which was about collectivism. Right, the American Revolution, John Adams wrote in the Declaration of Rights for the Commonwealth of Massachusetts, he specifically wrote about all men being born free and equal with certain inalienable rights. Right, it mirrors the, the, the Declaration of Independence in the United States. If you look at the Declaration of the Rights of Man in France during the French Revolution, it's the opposite. The, 19, the, the 1789 Declaration of the Rights of Man says, the principle of all sovereignty resides essentially in the nation, no body nor individual, may exercise any authority which does not proceed directly from the nation. It says law is the expression of the general will. So the collective always rules the individual. The group always rules the individual. And because the group always rules the individual, and because the group is always, th this is a very utopian view of the world. That the, the, because, see, the left doesn't believe in individual justice or that it can be achieved, but group justice can be achieved. But to pursue group justice is a utopian vision. You have to have this utopia in your head. Well, if the group is more important than the individual and the individual is in the way of progress, just steamroll the individual. And that's, how, and that's why you end up with communism killing 100 million people. Because the bottom line is that if you are seeking equality of outcome on a group level and somebody is an outlier, well, they're standing in front of the machine and they have to go. Individuals are either tools of the regime or they are obstacles to the regime. I wish someone could come save me right now from you. Right, well, I nobody has to save, save you because me. you're a fucking white man who gets to do whatever he wants to in this space, right? Aren't you quite aware by holding that video camera on me that you are surrounded by your privilege, right? Take your privilege somewhere else, please.
imperialism. Who created ISIS? Motherfucker! You look like an Uncle Tom, motherfucker! Your ancestors were taken here! And your ancestors were enslaved, you fucking idiot! He can get beat up for wearing that around here? Oh, hell yeah, absolutely. Without it. So just for wearing a shirt, though? Oh, absolutely. That nigga ain't fuck that nigga. Straight up. Welcome Nazi youth! Welcome Nazi youth! We need you! Kick all of everybody out! Please kick me out! Do you all hate women? 
You hate, you're afraid of Mexican people. You're afraid of anybody other than the I white man. Like two you're, you're just fearful. You're afraid of things. That's why you're, 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 you're making some pretty judgment, big judgments. When yeah. You don't know anybody here. I know what you're, I know what you're voting for. Police have announced that they are getting ready to let the people who have attended Trump's rally. They're going to let them. No justice, no peace. 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 Uh, we got a significant development right here. Let me see that. 
Donald Trump. Well, I thought that you're with him. You're an idiot for calling me an idiot. Dick sucking ass motherfucker. That's why you don't do shit. Swing at me, homie. Swing at me. Swing at me, homie. You ain't gonna do fucking shit. Obviously, you ain't gonna do shit. Agitator. Agitator. You're in the protest area. These are the people who dislike Donald Trump. Look how they act. Sure about that? People that he asked his his security guards to kick out of the rally. Oh, in Valdosta State. Tell me about. Oh, they were protesting against him. Yeah. What is that? You that cannot shit. protest in a, in a rally. Then why would you do that? Why? It's freedom of speech. We don't go to your rally. We don't go to your rally. He does the same thing to white people too. So I don't understand. He does the exact same thing to white people too. So and that's a, that, that makes it okay. I mean, you if, 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 you're, if you're gonna protest that's against us, paid for you. yeah, wow. yeah. They don't like Trump <laughs> supporters like freedom of protest. Speech. Okay, you should go get educated on what's oh, important. I'm very educated, yeah. ma'am. I'm, I'm very educated. <laughs> Hello everyone, hey, I'm just stopping by to remind you that liberals are insane. <laughs> Social justice warriors are becoming more violent and triggered than ever before. Anyways, be sure to subscribe to KGP TV on YouTube and have a blessed day. Yeah, man.